Mm. What are we going for guilds? Um, we can. I do kind of want guilds. Can we go for, uh, uh, I guess we can go for guilds. I haven't noticed the uh, scrolling glitch since the patch, so hopefully they got rid of that. Yeah, yeah, actually, yeah, maybe. I hope so. That was annoying. <laughs> oh, jeez, I'm not doing too well all of a sudden. Cities just started popping. Everyone just started making babies real quickly. Bug fixes. I don't see it though. The Terracotta Army is the uh, basically the Chinese burial ground of one of the leaders, or is it the Hun burial ground? Chinese. I know, but I'm trying to think. Was it one, when one of the Huns kind of took over? Mm, maybe. I don't think so. Yeah, but that's that's the, that's like all the clay statues of warriors protecting their leader. Yeah. I hope that archer does not take my workers. Can they? I don't think they can. I think they can. I think they changed it so they can. When? Because it's not a melee action. A uh, while ago. Tyre seeks a great profit. Well, there you go. And boy. How long do you, how long do you got? Uh, 15 to 85. 10 turns. <laughs> Jeez. You know, I'm I think you can actually six, buy them. Come to think of it, can you? Look you can your, buy them with faith. Look in your purchase menu. See if you can buy them. I'm. You might have to wait till after you get them first. I think we took that. Oh, whatever. Maybe you have to have. Yeah. Look at Honolulu. It's only eight or five population. It's only the only city that they've caught. He's building. He's building. I think the Terracotta army. <laughs> Maybe I should just let him do it and take it over later. <laughs> but it looks like it's what it's building. Should I get legalism or aristocracy? Aristocracy. Mm-hmm. Man, you're kind of close with that spearman. Yep. Well, there shouldn't... There we go. Yeah, I was going to say, there should be no reason why he would win. So, there are the locations of Team 3. Vienna, Rome, and Moscow. Nope, we know where they all are now. <sighs> Naval invasion of Vienna. Man, I think my subscribers ruined me. <laughs> I was such a peaceful civilization player. Now I just think domination like as soon as I see someone else. There's no problem in doing that. I don't think that's bad either. It's just the amount of time it takes to do it. Yeah. I gotta play like an epic or marathon game one of these days. I see a potential next city spot. Another one. Yep. Well, see, I was thinking you go buy the gold and the cattle down south. Uh huh. And then I can go to where the encampment is right now. I can. I, well, we'll see what else is up there. Yeah, that won't be bad. There's nothing apparently up there. You might get like oil. Maybe. You won't have access to that one stone, but you should have a naval city. You might want to check it, though. It might be in just another pot of water.
So what do you have to quasi? I can adopt another policy. Oh. Probably, I don't know, legalism or representation, I think. Collective rule. Get my third city out. Oh, yeah, that wouldn't hurt. Mm. Yeah, let's do that. Like you through. Yeah, you want to get your cities out relatively early, and I do agree with that location on that tundra hill. Only thing that's going to be a bummer is the road, so you may want to consider. Wow, Petra looks cool. I don't remember seeing it in my other city. You're not even done with it yet. Um, I'd recommend building a road to this new city, and then just building a harbor to Adrianople, or Adrianople. <laughs> Yeah, that's just a long road. That's a long road to nowhere. <laughs> Cause it's really well defended. Oh wow, pagodas are cheap. I didn't know they're that cheap. What do they cost? Two hundred. Yeah, yeah. The, it goes up as the game progresses, but you're gonna want a great profit first and enhance your faith. Yeah. I guess there is a plantation there. Oh. Yay, encampment destroyed. Hmm. Should I move my settler with my warrior or should I keep my warrior down here to get the spearman busy? Hmm. That is a very good question. No, because those two I'd plots say, are already pillaged, I'd yeah. say move them. I was going to say that as well. Very good. All I right. agree. Man, you're just getting really bad luck with the barbarians, aren't you? Mm-hmm. I was too. I haven't had like a single problem with them. But then again, I have been taking out encampments. I think I've already taken out three or four. Probably three. <sighs> and now my guys are unhappy. Gosh darn it, I want to build Machu Picchu as well. Yay, golden age. Got too much I want to build. Not enough production to build it. Oh well. It's not like Polynesia is getting any stronger. <laughs> Too bad you can't exchange maps in this. Yeah, that's kind of a bummer. Wait, wait, what? What? Why is my worker in the water? Where? Huh. Near Adriano Stupid Adrianople? Work. Oh, is he? <laughs> he wants to be captured by the barbarians. <laughs> what the heck? There's no reason for, for him to be over there at all. I, I automated him, but he can't go there like in one turn or something. And now the other worker is moving up. What's he trying to do? I don't know. No, unautomate him. Your game's like broken. Guys, you darn it in, boy. You got a higher score than me. Yay. I'm in a golden I, age, too. Except this, this you're, you're going to get one and then surpass me. No, I'm not. Well, I just got representation. That's how I got another golden age. Oh yeah, I'm beginning that next. Maybe no, I'm getting aristocracy next. Oh, I'm first in population. Catherine's the worst, which is good. I mean, she's probably not doing too well. Uh. 
Uh -huh. Still, Augustus Caesar is actually doing pretty good. You have twice as many people as me. Uh oh. with Bowman's already? <laughs> Who, Barbarians? Mm-hmm. Yeah, that shouldn't be too bad. Probably take him out with your Spearman. Yeah, it'll be a major victory. I just I just want to take out the encampment. <gasps> wow, he beat me to it. He must be just rushing stuff. I hope oh, he well. doesn't rush for Petra. Um, he can't. He doesn't have any buildings near the desert. All right. I guess that's why Petra hasn't been built yet. Yeah, that's one of the reasons. There are a couple tech or wonders that don't get oh. built very easily. I could uh, move Adrianople uh, out of the um, production focus. Yeah, but it would still take 23 turns before someone's born, so no, I'm going to keep him there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and once you get... Um, oh, shoot, can you re-offer me that deal? Was it, is it just the gold back? Yeah. Oh. What's your happiness at right now? 11. Okay, can you trade me gold for gems? I'm already trading my gold to Quasi right now. Well, it'll be neutral for both of us then. That's true. I'll just... I'm gonna you'll get need, gems you only have a little one? bit. I only have one. I'm, be I'm gonna be getting another one here in a minute, but you should be getting another gold eventually, oh. and you have enough. Right, I'm getting. I'm getting one soon too. Yeah. You haven't taken my gold yet, right? Oh. Can you just withdraw the offer? <laughs> yeah. I'm amending it. Gosh darn it. That's the exact offer I made. There we go. Okay, all is good. 625 BC. And we are gonna build. Yay! Mm -hmm. Ivory and. Yeah, I've, wow. Ivory connected for Quebec City and gold connected for. The other place. Awesome. May adopt a policy. Let's see, 13 turns. Let's see if it affects this. I'm pretty sure it does. Eleven. Whoop de do. How you doing, Quasi? Barbarians. Stupid barbarians. Mm, yep, I'm getting him too. Alright, looks like they're moving out. Yay, we got the guilds. Awesome. Should we get horseback riding or should we go for drama and poetry? Mm. Or should we go for engineering? Choices, 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 people. I guess engineering. I, I vote, I also vote engineering. Fair enough. Like engineering and then... Who... 
does anybody want to build, or who's going to build the Great Wall? Because I can, I have the, it, I definitely have the tech to be able to do it so. It really doesn't matter too much. I um, like the culture. Yeah. It, I think, nah, because I'm going to be the one the offensive the most. Yeah, either way. I don't think, and boy, are you even with anyone on your continent? Are you alone? Uh, I'm not positive of all the borders, but as far as I know, I'm alone. So you probably need the least. Oh, we'll see when we get there. Um, okay. I'm building Machu Picchu, so... Bam! Oh god. Ni, ni guy. How do you say that, really? Nicaea. Or maybe. Really? Nicaea. Yeah, it's Nicaea. It's. Wikipedia, tell me. Ni, 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 ni. I think this, the first A is silent. Yeah. I didn't know there was a first A. Nicaea. I think it's. Because when I think of like the Nicene Creed, it's N I C E A N. It's it's Ni Nicaea. Nicaea. All right. Uh, watch all this. Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. Good. Okay. What will we build? Uh. Okay, so in English it is Nicaea, and apparently in Greek it's Nicaea. Apparently. Where are you reading that? Um, I'm looking pronounce Nicaea. Pronunciation. A E. How do you say it? Has if one. I if I want to type Nicaea pronunciation in Google, okay. then it's say it the the suggestion it gives me is Nivea, Nivea products <laughs> um go to i don't oh, know if you can get bro. this how j say h o w j s a y dot com yeah i see it now all right and it'll say it for you i see it <laughs> yeah it's nice in english why thank you <laughs> all right i see it Okay then, we figured that out. Yeah, you I said actually Greek know how to pronounce Nikea? something correctly. Okay. Hmm. Greek Nikea. Did you see that as well? Or are you just saying what I said? What? Nike do you see how it's pronounced in Greek? No, I didn't see it, but I'm thinking about it. Nikea. Nikea or something like that. It'd be Nikea. There's no I. Yeah, Nikea. It is. In Greek, there's no I like. it's even I or something. Nikai. And it comes from Nikia, which means victory. Hmm. That's just weird. Production. Uh, what are we going to build? Colosseum. I have so many things to do. I don't know. Do you might want to consider building, um, like a ranged military unit, and you might want to consider attacking those bowmen. Yeah, I've got a spearman for them. Here they are. Oh, oh. what? Didn't one HP, even finish I bet. Him. It's got one HP. Six. Yeah, I'm going to follow him to his encampment, really. I'm getting sick of him. Yeah, you probably should get in range unit and just go barbarian hunting. Meh. Not how Constantinople looks, like On the map. Ah, <laughs> Tyre desires gold. That's ironic. Oh, a great merchant. Why, thank you. Hello. Austria has gotten gods of the sea, which makes sense. There's three fish right next to them, right next to Vienna. 
Any suggestions what I should do with my great merchants? Um, escort him to Tyre. You'll get mm, money. Yeah, and... maybe. Move Definitely. him along with these spearmen here. Uh, is there, are there any other cities? Not nearby that are um, seen. But it's a, it's a mercantile, so you get more happiness, which is never a bad oh. thing. Well, I was going to impress Tyre by getting gold. <laughs> Uh, would you mind impressing your own city states, please? <laughs> cool. hey, it's not my fault they want it. Go on, press the Borgia. Um, if Austria gets allied with someone, then please react. <laughs> Just make sure they don't get allied with anyone. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't yeah. want an Austrian city on my continent. Then late game, you really have to worry about that. Mm -hmm. Have you played yeah, against Austria? I always Austria? have to worry about that. And boy, you played against Austria yet? No. I have you, not. You know what their special ability is, right? Yep, they can buy out like a, a city state and make it their own. Basically. Uh, city. I don't know how much it costs, but. That's how they got Belgium. Well, wasn't, wasn't Belgium yet, but was the Duchy of Brabant and County of Flanders and all these things. They all got land because they married everyone. The Habsburg guys think these assholes. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't remember right. what, was it the Russian bloodline that was really messed up, or was it the Austrian bloodline? Hmm. I don't know. I'm just thinking like there was this one bloodline that was like really messed up from inbreeding. Yeah, it's the Habsburg. Habsburg dynasty. And that the Habsburgs are, um, well, Austrian. Like, so I don't know, is, have you, like, uh, from Crusader Kings, have you ever had that happen where you end up with um, someone who's inbred? Um, it, it is possible, but I, I pay attention to it. Yeah. I, I don't marry um, my... Yeah, my, my family, my, my dynasty members to each other, unless it's like a kinsman from further, much further away in the in the dynasty tree. Then I don't really mind, but I, I don't do it. I only do it if they like ask for it, like these two people get married, but I do pay attention to it. Yeah, I wish it was a yeah, little easier to see to... how the two of them were related, because you can only see how they're related to you and not to themselves. All right, someone's ringing my bell. I'll be back in a split second. Ringing your bell, it's like 2 a.m. over there. <laughs> Should I get religious unity? Do you have a prophet? Yes. Um, you're going for an enhancement, right? Yeah, what's a good enhancer? Let me see. So, yeah, now my bell, it's not my doorbell, but um, I my, my room. Well, not my bedroom, my bedroom is downstairs, but my room with my computer and all my nerdy stuff is upstairs. And my grandmother doesn't like walking the stairs every, every time she wants to say something. And that's why we have a bell there. And oh, okay. now she rang my bell because it, it's like, oh, it's almost 2 a.m. and you are still upstairs doing nerdy stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, uh, we'll wrap this up then. So what did you say you were looking for? A good enhancer belief. Um, holy order. I usually don't buy them though. Messiah. I usually don't use them. Religious texts. Either that or... Well, I was thinking unity, but you can only do that so many times. I guess text is the best one. So. Okay. Well, there we go. We're at turn 95. I guess we're going to wrap up this session. Who knows? We're going to start up the next one. So. Thank you very much for watching. And God bless.